hi guys welcome to technical video on how to apply custom CSS to an out-of-the-box list view using embed code in SharePoint online I have a page uh, FAQs page on this we I have an uh, FAQs list view which is a newsletter view I want to apply custom CSS to this so that uh, I can apply some backgrounds here I want to remove this and then some colors and font styling for this particular section over here which is nothing but uh, the questions and the description for those questions so to apply the custom CSS to this page first thing is we need the custom CSS uh, that we are going to apply I have an uh, styles here I have all the styles that I would need to apply uh, to this page what I have done here is I have picked the associated uh, classes uh, with these elements here uh, let's say uh, the first one MS view header TR this this is a class applied to this element here on the FAQs list view so when we say uh, display none this will disappear from the page the same way I have uh, picked up uh, all the classes that I want to change or apply CSS so we have the CSS ready let's go and upload the CSS to a style library from where we are going to provide the reference to okay in this style library I have already uploaded the same uh, FAQ styles file here uh, just just to shorten this video Okay, we'll use the same uh, file. Let's go and edit this page. Edit. If we go to insert, here we can see this embed code uh, option that has been provided by Microsoft uh, in SharePoint Online. This component helps us to embed the code or HTML snippets within the page so let's click on it once we click it will provide an uh, dialogue with an option to insert your snippet let's add the reference of the file that is the CSS file that we have on the style library let me just copy that URL and just say insert Here you can see uh, it's a script editor web part uh, that comes up on the page. Let's just save this page. Check it in. Publish. Now you can see we, we have added uh, a background to the header. We have removed that question and then uh, some background colors and font color uh, to these questions and then uh, for the description a little bit a background color is there you may just notice it so this this is how we do it thanks for watching this video uh, hope you like this video if you like please do like it and uh, also subscribe to my channel for uh, upcoming videos and also leave your comments uh, in case you find uh, anything that can be improved and also you are welcome to send me across uh, the technical questions you have or you would like to have the videos uh, i will probably get try to get those videos to you on my channel thanks thanks a lot